And, and they speak in symbols. The other thing I think I've learned from this is, and I think it was Manly P. Hall, the, the famous Mason, who said, yeah. when mankind learns to read symbols, then he's going to understand what's going on here. That's really true. This, it's all around us. You know, I was just in Winnipeg, Canada. My husband and I were walking down the street, and I saw this weird. I mean, you know you know how there's, there's art that makes you feel good. You see Madonna and Child, or you see, you know, the David, and, you, and it makes you feel good. Mm. But you see this, and it just makes you feel like, ooh, that's creepy, and I just don't want to be near it. And I thought, who, what kind of a business would put this thing? It was a weird looking dog and this thing, this kind of human-like human thing with what kind of a space suit. I don't know what it was. It was weird. And then I looked around at the building and the building had these symbols on above, above every window. And I just happened to know what that symbol was. And it was the ancient Babylonian symbol for Saturn. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know that. Symbol. You know that symbol. It kind of yeah. looks like an H. And I thought, wow. <laughs> <laughs> this city's infiltrated, I guess. I don't know. It's everywhere. Once you recognize it, it's pretty scary.